Ever since the introduction of Taptic Engine in iPhone 7, Apple has been all in on excellent when it comes to haptics. But even after that, the only way to get haptic feedback while typing on your iPhone was by using a third-party keyboard app such as Gboard. But not anymore because with iOS 16, Apple is bringing the satisfying vibration feedback to Apple's stock keyboard application using the powerful Taptic Engine. It comes disabled by default, but you can enable it by following these basic steps. Let's have a look at it. On your iPhone running on iOS 16, open the Settings app. Now tap on Sound and Haptics, scroll down a little and tap on Keyboard Feedback. And there you have it, a separate toggle button for haptic feedback. Enable it and that's it. Enjoy the satisfying vibration feedback on your iPhone without using any third-party app. If you're looking for a proper guide on how you can install developer beta of iOS 16 on your iPhone, then don't worry, we have it covered. Just make sure you tap on the first link in description or you can also tap on the i button. If you're looking for more videos on iOS 16, we have it all covered on our channel iGeeks Blog. So make sure you check out the recent videos and while you're at it, make sure you subscribe to the channel to motivate us for creating more content like this for you guys. If you'd like to stay updated with everything Apple, then make sure you download the iGeeks Blog app from App Store. That is it for this video. This is me, Yash, signing off and I'll see you in the next one.